going on guys back again with another video for this one i'm going to be showing you what arrived in the mail re pretty recently this arrived the day after christmas and also some other cars that arrived in the past month and so before we get to this one let me show you some of the other cars that I, i've acquired for the collection uh so recently i opened this guy finally this is the nissan Skyline gtr top secret this is the 2022 christmas limited edition I don't know if there's any chase version of this, but here it is, really quick, out of the package, really nice, Merry Christmas details on there, he's on Skyline, so there we go, that's that, and then we got some uh, Tarmac Works, I have this really cool one, it came in the like a little tin can packaging right here, the VLT. Uh, if you're not familiar with this, it's kind of like a drink. It's like a lemonade type drink that I used to have all the time as a kid. And so I had to get it for a nostalgia vibe. And the car that it is, is the Mercedes AMG GT3. Of course, with that VLT deco on it. Even some Moto on there. Um, this is the Daryl O. Young edition. So that's really cool. It looks like there's some extra stuff inside there, so... That's nice. Okay, let's put this back here for now. All right, and then we have some more Tarmac Works here. This is a Tarmac Works, Tarmac Collab 64. This is a uh, Mercedes AMG G63, the Shmi 150. I don't know what the Shmi 150 is. I just thought it was a really cool G-Wagon. I actually have another G-Wagon on the way. I'll show pretty soon. So that's a really nice one in blue metallic. Or, no, it doesn't really say the colorway, but it's nice and blue. And then we have another Tarmac uh, Global 64 here. This is a really cool uh, Pagani Zonda, uh, maybe Re Revolution. Um, really cool colorway. This one's in blue metallic. Really nice Pagani right there with the box art. Really nice. And then some mini GTs here in the background. Right there, we got this really cool um, BMW M3 with that Golf livery. Really nice. Um, pretty well detailed with these mini GTs. There we go. Then I had to pick up this guy right here in a second. I'm going to show you. I had to pick up this guy right here, um, the Nissan Skyline GTR, the Bayside Blue, but this is the Chase version to pair with my regular one. So this one's really cool. Really nice pair, those two right there. And then everything else is Hot Wheels. Pretty much, or actually before the Hot Wheels, I recently found these at Walmart. My very first Muscle Machines, Muscle Machine casting in the collection. This is the 1972 Datsun 240Z. I know these also have chases. Um, I think the Target chases are in red. And then I think the ones you can find at Walmart are like in black. But this is just the regular version, I'm sure. But... This is my first Mushroom Machines in the collection. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it's, it's pretty, they're all right. Probably not gonna buy any more unless it's gonna be a chase or something, but that's that. Then I also did a shorts on these. I uploaded not long ago. I actually did find these uh, on in the store at Walmart. This is the, the M2 Coca-Cola version. This is 1973 GMC Sierra. Uh, like I said, I did a shorts video on these. Um, I didn't find these on the pegs. Actually, I found them in a like a little uh, Christmas section in the store. They had some of these just laying on the shelves. Maybe because these these ones are usually picked up in my area. These are really sought after in my area, so that's a really cool find. As well as of course as this one right here, the. Uh, 1960 Volkswagen 4x4 delivery van. Again, really cool find for me. Uh, something that would have been picked up for sure, but 
I guess since it's, since it wasn't a it wasn't in the die cast or toy aisle, it was in a special Christmas, you know, section in the store where they had like like other stuff other than toys like clothing or other decors and all that. So that's a pretty cool find as well. And then everything else is Hot Wheels. So let's go ahead. Let me show you guys this. I picked this up recently as well. This is kind of like the five pack premium box set right here they got going on. I bought this one. I'm pretty sure you can buy these at Amazon. Um, I think I saw some from the Best Buy website when I was you know, looking through trying to find those Best Buy exclusive 36 count cases. I think Best Buy has some uh, online as well. I bought this one from Walmart right here. This is an older set that came out about maybe a year ago, year or two ago. It has a Chevelle, a Skyline R34, the Lycan Hypersport, the GR Supra, and the track clock right there. So that, probably gonna open those at a different time. And then, so I'll just put this back here. And then I found, well, I picked these up right here, these three from a local collector. I picked it up. This is Zamac 15. Uh, oh, these are not in order. So it's 13, 14, and 15. We have the A68 El Camino. We have the Batmobile, which is really cool, and Zamac, and then the Pontiac GTO, 06 Pontiac GTO. Those are all really nice. I think there's gonna be three more after this, and then Zamax will be done for the year. So let's see if I can find those, or if I'll just pick it up from a local collector. These ones I had to buy off eBay. These are the red editions, the last uh, sets of red editions. This is the 18 Camaro SS right here. Really nice. This is 10 of 12 for the year. 11 to 12 is the 65 Mustang, 2 plus 2 Fastback, and in the lot I bought these, there were two, the other one's hanging on the pegs right now, so, but there was two in the lot, and I bought them, and then here is 12 of 12, the last red edition for the year, 2023, this is the 18 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon, so, it has a cracked blister, unfortunately, but that's okay. So this is a really nice set. Then I also did find these on the store a couple of weeks ago. This is the 17 Ford GT. These are Walgreens exclusive. Um, I found a total of six of these in the stores, but I picked up three of them. Uh, try to get the best ones in terms of the card conditions. Um, the other two are hanging on the pegs as well, but I found six of these in those mini shippers. Um, I left three, so. They're cool. I think the past color from this year was a like a light baby blue color. And then this Walgreens exclusive is this really pretty neat green green color. So that's cool. That's a Walgreens exclusive. And then since Kroger, I don't have a Kroger uh, in my area, so I had to buy these online on eBay as well. Um, these are supposed to be uh, from Kroger. Um, I'm, we're still waiting on if they're gonna update the you know the website where they have the 36 count cases up for sale they're still right now I think they're unavailable uh, but they still uh, they're showing the ones that were from the past which is the one that had the 68 Dodge Dart the 68 Dodge Dart the McLaren and then there are the two exclusives so still waiting on um, the newer which should have these right here these have mks on them so if those ever pop up in the kroger website or in the kroger app um i'm still wanting to go for at least one silly case but here is one of them this is one of the kroger exclusives it's the mazda rx3 and it's really cool uh, blue color right here that's nice all right and then we have this cool 70 Chevelle SS wagon in this purple. Really nice. Cracked blister as well, so okay. 
So I bought these guys on eBay. Um, and then really cool one here, the Toyota Land Cruiser 80 in red right here. The mud wheels. And then probably my favorite from the these set of uh, exclusives from Kroger. This is the Ubby Works Lamborghini Urcon Coupe in that green, like a lime green color. Really nice. Okay. And then I also picked up some shorties pretty recently. Um, show you all this really quick. Uh, these are 2023 cars. Most of them are, yeah, all of them are all 2023 cars. These are uh, Tesla Model Y. This might be in the B case for 2023. I'm not exactly sure, but that's cool right there. All right. Okay, that's the Tesla. And then we have here the very cool, cool combi with the Moon Eyes livery on it. It's the back, the front. That's a really cool version of the cool combi. Really nice. And then we have the LB Super Soviet Nissan Soviet S15, which I believe this is from the A-Case, um, which I also bought some of the, or pre-ordered some of those Amazon black boxes, uh, A through D, A-Case, B-Case, C-Case, and D-Case. So that Liberty S15 should be there. And then we have this, this one too should be in one of those Amazon black boxes. This is a Nissan Patrol Custom. Um, I think for every new model for each case, um, it's gonna be in those Amazon uh, box, black box. So this is a really cool uh, Nissan right here, Patrol Custom. Really nice, the hood. Cool. And then we have three more shorties here. It's a really nice uh, 2023 Nissan Z right here in blue. It's gonna come back in 2023 in blue. Really nice, just clean. No crazy deco, just the taillights and the headlights. The black roof there. That's nice. And we have the Nissan Maxima Drift car right here. This one might be from the B case. That's cool. And the last, the last shorty is the Surf Crate right here. This is the regular treasure hunt from the B case. As you can see, there's a flame logo right there. And on the car itself, it's on the roof there, flame logo. So this is the regular treasure hunt um, from the B case 2023. Uh, so which is, this is pretty cool because I never really find any short cards and you know, uh, regular treasure and short car is pretty cool in the collection. All right, and then the last car, cars, um, that's in the video. It's gonna be in this box right here. Um, this arrived the day after Christmas, so on the 26th, um, which is okay. Um, kind of wish it arrived before Christmas, but that's fine. I took out the shipping label already, but this is basically the Hot Wheels Elite 64, and this is how mine came. Uh, unfortunately, there's no tape anywhere, um, so I'm kind of disappointed by that. Um, I already looked inside, they're both in here. I just, I already took out the paper, the paperwork, that's why I, I, I um, looked inside already, so I'm just disappointed that there's no tape in here, so let's go ahead and just it open. So it does come with this little bubble filler right here. Um, but then we'll just pull it out here. So I did order two of these. They did send them in the box, but unfortunately, they didn't put tape on this. So I'm not sure if I'm the only one that did do that too sure about its accident but basically this is the Hot Wheels Elite 64 this is the 1996 Toyota Chaser JZX100 um, this is the first Elite 64 that came out this was purchased through the Mattel Creations website and these come with a protector Hot Wheels brand protector um, so I did get two of these right here so Take it out of the protector really quick. 
I believe with these LA 64s, um, they are made out of 20 plus different parts. So that's probably a reason, the reason why they're pretty expensive, I think. They were $20, $25 plus shipping. But this is the chaser right here. It's a cool card art. Um, there's a window piece at the back so you can look at it. The other side, there's all that information right there. So I did purchase two of these. Um, not sure if I'm gonna go for every LEC 4 drop. Probably not, but this is really, uh, I think a lot better in person than it is in images. There's a base right there, as you can see the exhaust. The, the wheels, the blue wheels with the, maybe hard to tell, but there's a roll cage in there that's blue. And of course, the, the front end of the car is looking really nice as well. So that is that for this video. Um, thank you for tuning in as well. Uh, hope you guys like the video. And if you stay tuned for my other ones, I appreciate it. Now, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.